We begin with Vice President Kamala Harris's visit to Milwaukee. She's on her way back to Washington, D.C. right now after spending about four hours here in town. The Biden administration used her trip to talk jobs. Our Tony Atkins is live at UWM to lay out the VP's visit. Tony. Kristen, I'm actually standing in one of the two labs where Vice President Kamala Harris was shown and taught and just talked about sustainable energy. In fact, if you take a look right here on the floor, you can see one of the floor markers that says VP, trying to keep this all socially distant. I want to show you just one piece of technology that she was shown here today. This is an electric car charger like you would see in any parking lot. This is said to charge a electric vehicle in 15 minutes. This technology, one example of the sustainable energy the vice president hopes to push for with their new plan. Governor Tony Evers greeted Vice President Kamala Harris after she landed in Milwaukee. From the airport, it was off to Glendale. Good afternoon, Madam Vice President. Good afternoon. Oh. During a roundtable discussion, the Vice President touted the American Jobs Plan and how she says American infrastructure will benefit. I think of this as all very exciting. We are investing $180 billion in the American Jobs Plan and research and development. Harris called it the biggest non-defensive investment in our country's history. After the vice president departed, we caught up with some of UWM's engineers who gave Harris a tour of some of their labs. We were absolutely impressed with the follow-up questions and the understanding that she had. Engineer Adele Nasiri took part in the round table with Vice President Harris. She toured two labs, including one of his. UWM leaders say they're happy to see the administration looking seriously at sustainable alternative energy. There's a future coming up here and it's an electric future. They're all leading to a future that's going to happen. It's, we're not gonna be living in the past, we're gonna go to an electric future. And we also spoke to a number of people outside of this event that just wanted to see a glimpse of the vice president going by. They say they're excited to see her coming to Milwaukee to discuss sustainable energy, but they also want to see that money going into infrastructure in the years to come. For now, reporting live in Glendale tonight, Tony Atkins, TMJ4 News. Thanks, Tony. Head at six, Vice President Harris talks jobs and COVID one-on-one -on -one with Charles Benson. She shares the types of jobs the infrastructure plan could create and if she thinks Wisconsin will reach herd immunity. Wisconsin Republicans responded to the vice president's visit, saying in part, quote, she is coming to Wisconsin to promote Biden's wasteful $6 trillion tax and spending plan that will ruin the economic recovery and saddle our children with unsurmountable debt.